Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be doing something that, uh, well, you know what, everything we do seems simple, whatever it's, you know, uh, thought of, but in actuality, it's a little difficult. So, uh, today guys, we're going to be replacing shocks. And I'm talking, whenever I say shocks, I'm not talking about like struts, stuff like that. I'm talking about the hatch shocks. So, uh, yeah guys, that's what we're going to be doing. I have the ones for this big hatch here and I have the ones for the hood, so we're going to replace them both of them. Alright, so uh, you can get new shocks for your car for about $15 to, to $30, depending on where you get them at. Uh, I slack auto parts, I think they're $15, and you can actually get them really cheap on Rock Auto. Now, I'm not sponsored by them or anything, but they really do have good prices on the parts. So, uh, I got these shocks here. Basically, I have these short ones right here. For the hood, I have two of these. And then I have these long ones for the uh, big hatch here. So, uh, what you're going to want to do is you're either going to get someone else or you're going to need to get some way of holding this thing up while you pull the shocks off. Because once you pull the shocks off the car, there's going to be nothing helping you anymore. It's going to be just you holding that thing up. So, uh, yeah. So, that's what I'm going to go do now. I'm probably going to grab a piece of pipe to hold it up. And uh, we're going to be pulling them off. I'm going to show you to pull them off. Okay, guys. So, when you do this, like I said, you're going to have to have something to hold this up. Currently, I have a six-foot step ladder right here with this little box on top of it to catch it whenever it falls a little bit. But um, basically, guys, these are the shocks that hold up your car. Okay, you probably already know this, but I'm just going to go over it just in case some of you don't. Basically, if you'll notice, on this particular model, there is a retainer clip right here. And there's another one up here. Really, you only have to pop one of these off. And uh, the one that I prefer to pop off is the top one right here. Uh, which basically, you take a screwdriver, and you get under there with it, and you kind of pry it up, and it pops right off. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to show you how to do that real quick. And... Uh, We'll get these shocks off and get the new ones back on. Alright, so like I said. Okay, so now that that retainer clip's off, you're going to pull it, and it's going to fall down on that. And as you can see, that holds it up really good. And this one, you don't have to pull the retainer clip off. If you pry it a certain way, we just pull right off the ball. And now the old chocks are gone. We're going to go ahead and install the new ones. Okay, guys. So this is whenever it comes in handy to have another part system whenever you're installing the new one. Because you're going to have to hold this up while you install the new one. So I am I am going to be able to do it by myself, but it definitely helps to have a secondary person. Okay, guys. So uh, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to remember the orientation of your old chalk. And you're going to want to put the new one on the same way. So uh, this one keeps on like this in particular. And it should just push on to the uh, new thing and should be good to go. All right, the very last thing you have to do is pick up all the way to its full extension. And there you go, your new shock has been played. And these just pop on. You don't have to pop up any clips or anything, they just snap right in. Really easy and simple. There's a life I lead in this city Hurry and to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get Two different size shocks, uh, you probably already knew that Because you have to use little shocks on this one um, I'm actually not using the six foot step order on this one I'm actually using a pipe to prop it up right there So uh, yeah guys, it's pretty much the same method But I am going to show you exactly how I do it on this one Just so that you guys can be very good like understanding But I'm not going to talk anymore It's just going to be time Wait, hold on, put me together, take me back where I belong I want it all, I had a feeling but the feeling is all gone Wait, hold on, put me together, take me back where I belong I want it all, I had a feeling but the feeling is all gone I could take you back to my youth And show you what I wish I knew 
My will is strong with a place to lean. 